these Ole Miss Rebels already know what they'll be wearing for the first game this weekend. At Nielsen's, the oldest department store in the South, employee Abigail Clement shares some trends for women to wear in the Grove this year. Ruffles are big, maxi and midi dresses are making a come in, and sparkles. I love wearing dresses on game day, so I would definitely say a dress, a cute sneaker, because you want your feet to be comfortable all day in the Grove. Participating in this tradition of dressing up for Thank game days is a known thing among Ole Miss students. It would probably be like a super, super loose like mini dress because it's so hot. Um, so that would keep me from like overheating and it was really cute. This Ole Miss tradition is expanding yeah. across the SEC. That's how it is at like Bama State. So uh, yeah, I think it's definitely more of a southern food. Every football season, there are new fashion trends in women's clothing. Men's clothing, however, tends to stay the same. Nielsen's employee, Reed Bingston, is keeping track of what the men are wearing this year. Just a game day polo, whatever the color is for the week. Um, I guess guys still love like the khaki pants, the Wranglers, which is a bit odd to me, but um, good for them if that's what they're into. But yeah. I'd say new trends, but I would definitely say a lot of collared shirts, a lot of stuff with the Mississippi logo on it. A lot of Ole Miss, a lot of Hottie Toddy, and a lot of Eli. But whatever they're wearing, fans are ready. Probably not going to be dressed to the nuns, but definitely a nice polo. Um, probably some khaki shorts or something like that. And uh, just very rough and roll at this first game. Olivia Wright, Newswatch Ole Miss.